Welcome guys, we're back here at Fanatics and Dothan. We're going to film another bat rep. I'm going to go inside a little bit. Uh, I'm actually not playing in this one, so I'm going to be able to uh, have a little bit more freedom in the filming, hopefully. Uh, I'll be right back with you in a minute when I get in there and we check out everybody's army. Okay, first thing you note, we've got five battle wagons who have the scout special rules. I only used them on these three. I have... Uh, Four squads of 18 orcs, three of them have power claws, one of them does not. And then we have two war bosses. This is the, the warlord with the uh, thinking cap that lets me infiltrate two of my squads. And I've got one unit of tank buskets. And that pretty well covers it. Now they, the war bosses, of course, have power claws, one each. All right, that's Dan's orcs. He's going to be going against uh, Iron Hands, and we'll show you those in just one second. Be right back. All right, so we've got uh, 1,850 points for the Iron Hands. We've got four tack squads, each with a melted gun, sergeant with a power or the bolt pistol and chainsword. Uh, combat squatted, so we've got five Marines in each Rhino, and then the five in the f other four individual combat squads over here. We've got a five-man bike squad with a Liberian with the four sword mastery level two we rolled uh, terrify and mental fortitude um, then he gets the primers of psychic shriek as well we've got a chapter master on the bike with shield eternal and we're going to try the burning blade this time instead of the uh, power fist both the librarian and the chapter master have digital weapons this is not a land raider it is uh, cloaked it's actually a, a sikarin battle tank it's got uh, the accelerator auto cannon it's got uh, the Unor Crusade Legacy of Glory, which gives me preferred enemy orcs. And then it's got uh, Sponson Heavy Bolters. And then in reserve, I've got the Stormwing Formation, two Storm Talons, Assault Cannon, and Skyhammer Missiles. And we've got Storm Raven, Twin Link Multi Melt, uh, Twin Link Assault Cannon. And that is my fun times. All right, guys, those are the Iron Hands, and it goes to show you that you don't actually have to. Oh, lost the zoom. You don't actually have to have the exact model. If you have something you can sub in, your opponent's willing to let you do it. It works fine, you know. You don't uh, spend the money you got. You don't have to go broke playing this. All right, we'll be right back with uh, all Iron the hands. details. Oh, Iron Hands. Let's get all those details out first. Um, what are we doing? We're doing the scouring. We are doing uh, Nova tournament. Uh, Primary primer round two, which is scouring. We've got three objectives each. Uh, they're numbered, uh, they're point value one through three. So my objectives here, I've got uh, the one point value. Over here on this side of the ruins, I've got my three point and two point. And then Dan's got his over here. One, two, and three. And three that here. was random. <laughs> I don't want it there. Three over there. And hey. then we have our secondary goals. Um, you pick from a pool of three secondary goals, and I'm taking Line Breaker, Marked for Death, which is I pick a unit, I kill it, I get a victory point, and then Warlord as well. Um, and just so you know, Dan, I'm marking your Warlord for Death. Bring it. I'm, it's already been brought in. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, let's, let's film the rivalry in. here. Oh, yeah. I'm taking First Blood, Kill Points, and Marked for Death. And guess what I'm picking? That rhino over there, because I want double victory points for getting first blood off this. this uh, <laughs> there you go. I'm okay with that. All right. All right, we will be back with uh, whose turn first? Iron Hands, turn one. Iron Hands, turn one, movement. We'll see where they move to and uh, what the results are. Be right back. All right, this is what they did. The column, uh, just noticed these orcs coming in on the side, so they've tried to turn. A couple of attack squads jumped out to protect the column of the Iron Hands. Probably they're delivering some ammo or something to uh, outpost somewhere. They've turned to take these orcs out. Everybody else here just kind of moved up just a little bit, not much. There's some, most of this stayed still. They're going after these, but not quite in melter range, unfortunately, because we wanted to see some giant lava pools of orc trucks, but that's not going to happen. All right, we're going to shooting phase, and I think there's going to be a lot of it, guys. Psychic phase first. Oh, psychic phase. Psychic phase. Let's go ahead and do the psychic phase on the film. I'm going to do this. All right. Psychic phase. So we're getting five, five dice. All right. And we are mastery level two, so I get seven dice total. I'm going to use your yes. box there, fella. I get five dice to stop you? Oh, boy. You I can do five something. Five dice to stop me. Oh. All right. We're oh. going to do Psychic Shriek, which is Warp Charge 1. Mm -hmm. 
you succeed. Uh, I'll try to stop that. Okay. I'm going to swing six dice at it, and no six. No stops. No uh, and then, not in range for Terrify. So, I'm going to not Where do you doing both? Huh? Why do we do Shriek in the first place? Okay, I thought you were doing Terrify. Shriek is 18 inch. Oh. Terrify is not 18 inch, is it? I was, I was thinking the Tyrion version. I apologize. Mm -hmm. Double check here real quick because I have not ever used. All right, double checking the rules. <gasps> double checking the rules. No, no, I don't. No need to film this. Cut it out. Cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I can use it. Twenty-four inches. Oh. Twenty-four inches. So, Everybody was wrong. Last four. Four shot. On terrify. I'm gonna do three actually. Mm -hmm. Goes off. No perils. Mm -hmm. And one. just in case, we're gonna do one at force, which does no. not go off. Did not go off, guys. Alright, so right. no instant death goodness. Woo! But we've got Terrify and we've got Psychic Shriek. Alright, who's All your right. target? This unit here. Okay. We'll do Psychic Shriek first, which is 18 inch, 3d6 against leadership. 3d6 against leadership. Mm -hmm. Okay, leadership is 7. Alright, and you pass. Yeah. Look at them right. ones. Then, Look at them ones. It's gorgeous. I'm good at rolling bad. <laughs> <laughs> You're good at rolling low, and that could that could be bad for me. Terrify is um, uh, negative one. So I believe take another leadership test. Another one? Two d six or or is it three? I'm not sure on that one, Dave. Which one? Terrify. Malediction has a minus one to the leadership and trade on the units is having the fear special rule. Okay, so, so I, there's no test. My leadership is six, six for the next one. <laughs> okay, so it's automatic. He just has a minus one to his minus leadership. Minus one. We're okay with that. All right, that was All the right. end of the psyche phase. We're going to we come stuff. back on the shooting phase. Be right back, folks. I'm bringing you guys back because he decided to use his orbital bombardment right over here. So we're okay. going to see what happens here. So we're going to drop a. It goes here. <laughs> we're going to drop a strengthened we'll blast here. Okay. Directed. And it hits. So that's it one, hits. two, three, four, five, you see that over five there. guys. And I'm gonna, that's if you don't roll a one, I'm gonna have to make them. Four, five, six. Another six? Yep. One, two, okay. three, four. Five, six. You're correct. Okay. All right. Let's see what happens from the orbital bombardment. See this hole in the middle of the orb. Ones, ones, two right. ones. All right. So that's uh, four, four casualties. And the center was this guy. One, yep. two, three. Hmm, the question. Look out, sir. Not a four plus. Okay. Good. Yeah. So our closest to him this time. Okay. Cool. Big hole. We'll be right back with the rest of the shooting results. Coming back with a morale check for the orcs because if you notice, just a few guys missing here. Here's the dead pile from that unit. But look right here. Wow. Lots and lots of dead orcs. A lot of fire coming from the Marines. Let's see if and it's And the enough. orcs don't care! That's right. Yeah, I don't think the orcs care. We're going to see what happens. This is green skin standing strong. Uh, wow, it's a... Uh, we're coming back with orcs movement. Turn one. See you in a second. All right, there was a lot of movement. We're going to move on to the shooting phase after we show you this, but uh, probably no shooting going to be on this side of the board. Everybody over here ran. These guys jumped out of their truck. They're all running. They're gonna... Battle wagon. Oh, yeah, battle wagon. I'm sorry. They jumped out of their battle wagon. Which is basically the trucks are for, or yeah, the trucks. The trucks are for. Uh, I used to have a lot of trucks. If, if you didn't know, orcs are British rednecks, so they're basically just trucks. Soccer thugs. <laughs> Soccer thugs. But uh, we'll probably have some Soccer shooting thugs. over here. So yeah, run moves. The orcs oh. are piling in. Those tax squads over there are, are looking at a whole here. lot of orcs. We'll see what Maybe happens. As well as in orc yeah. shooting <laughs> for turn one. All right, guys. There was no shooting on this side of the board. But over here, if you notice, there's just one Marine standing. Uh, and that was just from a hail of fire that came and a hail of failed armor saves and feel no pains. It was, it was kind of funny, actually. It was, it was, it was very, very Man. devastating for the Space Marines. One Melt-A-Gun left, though, so he may be able to cause some damage over here on the vehicle, uh, which has moved up close. So maybe he can get it to explode and take a few orcs out. So we are now moving, rhino. oh the rhino, we forgot, oh rhino got killed, but that was kind of expected, some rhinos going down. He didn't blow up, he didn't cause any Which was first mess. blood in extra victory. Yeah, points. how many points did that in that That gave him five points towards his secondary in total of six. Okay, so the total is now five to zero right now. Five to zero. Five to zero, all right guys. 
We're moving on to Iron Hands. Turn two, move. No, no, nope. nope. I got assault. assault. Oh, we, we yep. had assaults already. Okay, I'm going to charge both the tactical squad and the rhino behind him. Okay. All right, we're going to fill in this. Well, I have to and charge the tactical he makes squad. The if the other guy died, I'd be in real trouble. Yeah, and I'm going to Overwatch with oh, the sure. melted gun. Sure, go ahead. And with the two Marines inside. No, you can't. It's not open top. It's got firing points. It has it's got two, two fire points. Okay, fire you points. Yeah, fire. okay, you can. It does have two yeah. fire points. Go for it. Sparks don't care. All right. So there's more where that, that came from. We'll do the first. We'll do from there first. I was thinking the rhino itself. Okay. Two orcs down. All right. Two orcs down. I don't get a cover safe. No, not really. <clears throat> okay. And then the melting gun. Mm -hmm. So Missed. four. Missed. All right, here's the charge distance. I can reroll one of these if I don't like you it. Don't. But I think nine will do. Nine inches. He's charging in. Nine will do. Okay, so first guy goes to the tactical squad. All right, we're going to bring you the results of this uh, assault right after a moment. Be right back. Okay, guys, into the assault phase. So Melted Gun Marine is, of course, 20, been overwhelmed. 20, 20, 40, 40, 40, 40. The Rhino has been knocked out, and he is in the process of placing the... Uh, the combat squad and tactical well, squad that was in there the around the oh, so then it would damaged be vehicle. Five and, a half. and now we are so moving on to Iron Hands. Turn two movement. I'll, I'll we'll be right all, back. All See what the Iron Hands can do in response to this green <laughs> horde. Okay, he's doing just a little bit more of his movement, but I'm going to start filming here, guys. These guys rolled four that came in. Tactical squads are moving up. They're uh, secure, se the securing this objective. <laughs> They're getting Let's close drop. to that objective down there with the tech squads. And these guys decided to just climb over their vehicle over here. Let me zoom in on that. They just said don't care. They climbed right over their vehicle and they're going straight for those orcs. All right, shooting phase for turn two. Iron Hands coming up next. All right, we're going to come back in here at the end of the shooting phase for the morale checks. See if Dan's units pass. For this one. Uh, six, seven, eight. Yeah, they passed. That one passed. Uh, they were leadership six. No, they Nine. were leadership six. These yeah. guys are leadership six. Yep. That's, the, that's the important. And they right, passed. They're good. They passed over here, and this is the final one. They no, no, no. Oh, no. These guys here more. This squad. Seven. They passed. They passed, and then they lost their truck and most of their squad. Nine. They passed. Woo! <laughs> so all the orcs are staying, and you we're can like, see what happened here. We're like, this is a good fight. And this now, sir, I truck shall assault you. Bloated, right. everybody in that's on. gone. All right. And he shot most of these Tech guys squad. out. So now we're going to they Iron Hands do. Assault. Yes, can. They are not an open top vehicle. If it blows up, they can't assault the next turn. They had to do emergency uh, debarkation. It doesn't matter. If you're, you're not in an open top vehicle, you can't assault the turn after you get out of it, one way or the other. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Bikes. So bikes are going to assault. Minus First thing, Overwatch. Yep. Minus two is not going to get in. Yeah. I need the five. Uh, this guy doesn't have line of sight. I'm going to have to measure. Um, he has angle. It looks like everybody else. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen Overwatches. Yeah, I know. Let's see if he takes some bikes out. The bikes yeah. did not get in. They couldn't get over the uh, wrecks of the rhinos. I got one hit. Let's see if I roll five. He does. Cover save for you. <laughs> see if he fails the cover save. No, okay. not with a six. <laughs> He's wearing power armor. He ain't worried about a little pistol action. All right, any more uh, assaults? Uh, that is not, and that since I failed that assault, that's going to be end of my turn. Okay, that was the end of turn of Iron Hands. In turn two, we're going to move on to Orcs turn two and see if they can have some vengeance for their... Blowing up vehicle here with a war boss, I think. That's the big war boss yeah. right there. Warlord is putting it. Warlord, and he is worth Nothing extra long. kill points, so we'll see what happens there. All right, guys, we'll be right back. I missed the wah, guys. Oh, we're back. We're going to do the wah here, and uh, Dan is going to move forward. So we're going to see this giant pile of orcs. This is just dead, actually, right here. So Dan's dead. There is a gap here that I can use to get through here. He's That's going right after there. the space so marine. We'll be back when I'm his movement is done. Alright. I gotta pack all this crap up. Dan's packing his stuff up, but we're gonna show where he moved. He got these uh, black squad, I guess he calls them, uh, moved into the truck. The warlord broke off from them and joined the red squad over here. Blue Squad jumped out of this truck that Black Squad now occupies, and they tried to charge through the terrain here, but 
didn't well, I, get I very still far. I charge distance, but I, I was and I kicked didn't, quite. didn't get very far. Not these, yet. These guys have moved up. These guys have moved up. The truck is repositioned to try to take out one of the storm talons. And most of the, the orcs have moved up. Dan has been rolling ones for his run move, so the orcs are kind of so slogged far, down. I'm good at that. All right, so we'll come back with the uh, shooting phase. Uh, turn two for the orcs. Just a minute. We decided to film the shooting phase because Dan only has two small, or two units. They're not small, they're orcs, but they actually have any shooting whatsoever because everybody else ran. One, two, three, four. Uh, no, I gotta shoot these guys too. I saw yeah, 15 that is, rockets going that is the fire. truck. No one cares wagon. about the truck full of rockets. Wagon, 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 wagon. <laughs> They're taking over. To 15 truck. rockets at the, at the flying uh, squad there are going to probably hit one of those little ones I actually think first. it's you very clean on the side of that. And I'm oh, I'll do the closest one. I okay. want to have a line of sight to you. One, okay. two, three hits. Three hits. You want to jink? I didn't jink. Okay, well you should have done you that before I shot. I did. Okay. I did. I did. <laughs> okay. One gets in. All right. Penetration roll is a five. Plus eight is 13. And I penetrate. Let's see. Uh, one. One. Woohoo! Uh, so we lost the whole point and you just snap fire next, right? Yep. Alright. Not so bad. Okay. On this storm talent right here, got hit with the whole point. What are we shooting next here? I'm shooting this squad and this tactical squad on top of the wreckage here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Uh, where was it? 15 dice? 15 dice. Five man tech squad. If I get so think one of them, left. I'm doing good. Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I got three armor saves for you. Three wounds. See so you have a range do. Might kill one. Oh, Whoa, two. two failures. Still got to feel no pain. Oh, yeah. And Still it misses. This one here? No, the one on top of the rhino. On the rhino? Yes. You good? All right. Yay! Three more. It's down to two. Okay. We got one, two, no, wait. three, no, only two dice. Because I saved one. Six, seven. Seven dice from this green squad with a war boss in it. Okay. okay. Two hits, two armor saves. That's nice. Okay. Why? Oh. Why do you curse me, dice? Oh, oh one dice. One. Made one field of pain. Got one field of pain. One, one marine died. Okay. All right. Dan is going to be looking at his assault moves. We'll film that in just a second. All right. This is the end of the assault phase. Turn two for the orcs. Oh, let's start right here in the middle. They took out that tactical squad and then they split. They're running for cover from the aircraft, is what it is. Under here, these guys are still locked in combat here. The Space Marines broke, but they just uh, regrouped. Over kind here, before they could run away, the sergeant is standing on top of the rhino. Pile of orcs. He's just cutting through him with his chainsword. I'm sure he'll be fine over there. No problem. Mm -hmm. And locked in combat over here with a bunch of orcs. Uh, tactical marines everywhere. Mm -hmm. Fighting for their lives. Fighting for the emperor. Alright. Turn three. Iron hands. Let's see what their answer is to the orc menace. Alright. Update on the score. Three to five. Dan is still ahead with the orcs, but... Uh, this rhino has come towards this objective in here. He's got this unit here that is with the objective. You can just see through the window, it's that uh, bright green. And then this tank here is still holding this objective back here. Uh, tactical squad moved up. His uh, little squadron here, that isn't a squadron of flyers, has moved over and is going after the trucks. Wagons. Wagons, sir. Wagons. Look, I, I think I see Krispy Kreme on the side of that one right there. I'm pretty sure that... Okay, we'll go with wagon. <laughs> All right, here the uh, bike squad is basically going to smash into the side of this uh, consolidating orcs here, and we're going to see what's going to happen. Though, psychic phase. little psychic phase. He's probably going to. Let's see what's going to happen. All right, that means I can four, roll four. We'll see if Dan can stop his psychic phase. All right, zoom out here. Force goes off. No perils. Mm -hmm. Psychic Shriek. Oops. Goes off no perils. Ooh. Oh. He stopped it. He stopped the Psychic Shriek. 
<laughs> Sweet. All right. All right. So we'll be back right back with uh, the results of shooting phase. Right. See you in a minute. Into the shooting phase. Flyers disintegrated the truck. Um, more guys survived, but uh, then they got all shot up by the rest of the flyers. Have some uh, glancing hits and some immobilized results on that. Oh, your morale check here. Yeah, oh, morale check. Five, it's good. Wow. Those guys aren't running. Uh, it's immobilized over there, nothing too bad. Uh, a lot of shots in here. This Team Red here, Orc Red unit, Squad. is messed up. Yeah, a few guys got killed over two. here. Leadership nine, good. Okay, they made their morale check. Now we're going to go into the assault phase. But I want to give you guys, hold on. I want to give you this shot right here. Here come the bikes down at them. All right, we'll be back in just a minute. We're letting Dan consolidate so over there. We're going to start right? here. Uh, yeah, this lone marine is left alone over here on the far side right, of the board. So I'm getting ready to... In the middle, the red uh, awesome. squadron of orcs was wiped out by the combined efforts of the tactical squad and the bikes rolling in over their skulls. It's quite a, quite a mess. That lone sergeant is still up there on that rhino He's with his chainsword. He is chopping through those orcs while his buddy uh, is down over here. He blew the orcs that were down here out. Uh, this tactical squad over here has been wiped out and the orcs are moving forward towards the rhino, I guess. And there's still some uh, fighting right here. So now we're moving on to orcs movement. And wow, only turn three. A lot going on in just three turns. Orcs movement, turn three, when we get back. Okay, what's the score, guys? Seven to five. Score is seven to five. I would well, tell I don't know you the kill points are. about I don't know the. If we counted during or I kill points get counted at the end. Yeah, I'm not. Okay. They're playing by some certain set of rules, so I can't tell you exactly how that's going. They're uh, emulating a tournament for practice. Orc moves. Moved up here. Gonna assault that. More boss split off to assault that. Um, these guys are going after that rhino over there. Kind of adjust, adjusted there in the train, train in the middle there. The truck, the trucks, trucks, no wagons. They keep saying Yay! wagons. You got it right. The wagons. And these guys moved up. This wagon also did a little uh, orc uh, U-turn, I guess. Yes, so don't get shot in the butt so much. <laughs> and then these uh, rocket launcher guys have moved up. So they can fire on these tactical marines who decided that the best place to be was out in the open. And they got hit. And uh, this is the beginning times. of shooting phase. Uh, and look what Dan did. Hit them five times with rockets. So Here let's see the, the results of that. Okay, four of them are dead. Four dead. All right, we'll bring you the rest of the results we'll from shooting in just rockets. a minute. Okay, the only shooting was right here. The marines, three of them, four, four died. And now Dan is moving up for some assaults. He's got some orcs assaulting over here. Overwatch. We've got Overwatching. some here. We're going to see what happens here. Marines are overwatching as the orcs charge in. There's not very many orcs left. Uh, four and marines and a pistol. we got five orcs. Two tasty sixes. All right. So one yep. cover save. No, nope. no, it's a cover save. Ah, rabble, rabble, rabble. <laughs> All right, 2d6 minus 2. Ooh, I got a 1 and a 3, but I get to reroll one of the dice, and it's still a 1, so I make 2 inch charge. 2 inch charge. It's enough to get in, but eh. It's it nice to have it a little closer. It'll do. All right, we'll that bring you the results of do. all these assaults in just a minute. Right, with the results, this Marine su succumbed to the overwhelming horde of orcs, but there's good news for the Marines. Um, they kind of a tie in there, right there. Uh, but they, uh, they lost this sergeant up here is uh, I lost combat still body. shopping. Okay. Uh, but they lost this rhino, and they're down to a man there. And this rhino is damaged. So actually, that's not good news at all for the Marines. <laughs> a lot of stuff knocked out. Some Marines down. The bike squad is going to have to do something. But uh, we're moving on to turn four, right? For Iron Hands, let's see if they can. Uh, oh wait, we forgot to. Do oh yeah, we already did. Let's see if they can knock some stuff out on the orc side and uh, turn this around. They still have all their flyers, so that is going to be one of the pivotal units. All right, we'll be all right. All right, Iron Hands are pretty much done with our movement. We'll just uh, sweep the board here a little bit. All bike squad ran around here trying to take out the tank busters. These guys are in hover mode. They look like they don't have much love over here for his remaining orc units. His war boss knobs over here. That's going to be interesting. 
And then uh, this, the Storm Raven, dropped down into hover mode. And uh, his big tank actually, well, you can say it moved. It just jumped to the other side of the forest. But I think these two trucks over here for that? Okay. and this uh, unit of orcs here is going to see a whole lot of fire and the shooting and psychic and all this. So we'll see, uh, we'll see what he does for psychic phase. We'll get that on tape. He only got one die. He's given Dan. Get one tonight. He's given Dan no chance to deny the psychic streak this Weird time. Uh, he there? succeeds only once. <laughs> yeah. What is their leadership? Never give up. There's uh, leadership six, seven. Seven. Uh, choices, choices. What's I'm going to kill him with the bikes anyway, so I'm going to throw three on the psychic streak. Yeah, one, two, six. six. Nice. All right, so three d six. So psychic streak oh. is going to go off. So you've got ten. They take three wounds. Right. Ooh. No saves. I'm going to take them around, check them into the section phase. Correct. Which one? They break. Fall back. Seven inches. Ah, so they still going to charge. Took some wounds and they're falling back. All right, we'll bring you the results of the shooting phase in just a minute. In the shooting phase, if you look over here, no more rockets. They're all gone. That truck is also missing, exploded, but the chapter master threw his body in between the explosion and just absorbed everything with his awesomeness. Uh, a few orcs here were picked off really? by the Storm Raven. Right. And uh, this truck was immobilized by the tank here. Uh, this truck over here, oh, I'm sorry, this wagon mm -hmm. took a few uh, shots Ow. at it. They wagon. shot a lot of uh, Storm Bolters at it, but they just pinged off the rear Heavy armor. Bolters. Didn't do very much to it. All right, we're going to move on to assault phases. I think we have one here, and one, one over there, and then this sergeant up no, here. No, we don't have one over there. With the chainsaw. So just here and there. Just chopping away at that. Let's see who lives. My turn. Be right back. Fire hands. End of the assault. Uh, this is still ongoing. One marine left, two orcs. That sergeant up there on the uh, rhino managed to win that, and he's moving over to secure this objective right here. Mm -hmm. This marine won his combat. He's securing that objective. Uh, some notes. It will not die. The flyer got back its hull point. Mm -hmm. It will not die over here. He got back a hull point. So that's about it for the assaults. We're moving on to Dan's turn four for the orcs and see what he can uh, come up with. See you in a bit. Can't All right. This unit disengaged from the rhino. They're chasing down that sergeant because of the objective. These guys push their way out of the cover and moving over and then the orc battle wagon decided to uh, ram the tank and they bounced off each other. No effect. So now we're moving on to the assault phase for the orcs turn four. It looks like the battle's winding down. We'll see who wins. <laughs> okay, we're coming back to film this because Dan just rushed in with the power car and exploded the tank. It was a pretty Bob awesome thing. And the rest of these guys. All right, how many got there? So we're going to see who lives one, two, through three, the four, explosion. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten regular, ten plus them, and then another nine. So, <laughs> well, ten and then one. Go over here. Bar when you're white rice. <gasps> white rice. White rice. So here, see who lives. Wow. Clear. We've got one, two, three, four, and six up armor saves. And a maid, one. Woohoo! Three down. Only Not three bad. Dead for a, a wow. Relic. That's fantastic. Yes. Hey, explosion. Pretty cool. He's been kicking my ass all game. He yeah. deserved it. Um, and yeah, that's really the end of the salt phase. So we'll go explain the rest of what happened. The sergeant finally fell. The orcs uh, came after him. To consolidate into the cover over here. Three inches. And over here on the other side, this Marine also in the building here. All right, keeps falling over. Fell as well, and the orcs consolidated up. So Dan's going over here. He's moving in. Take the objective. Moving on up. And that is the end of turn four. We're moving on to ten five, turn five. Iron hands. And I think there's going to be a lot of action from the flyers. We'll let you know what happens. Be right back. All three sixes. All right, uh, they're rolling the dice for the psychic phase. I'll show you the movement. Flyer moved up here. This flyer moved over here. Bike squad flyer. Every, apparently, there's something in those orcs' hands that the space marines really want because the rhino, the bikes, flyers, everything is going after that tiny orc force. Mm -hmm. And one more look at the remains of the tank. The molten slag and the orcs are rejoicing for a slight victory. All right, we'll be back with the results of shooting phase. See you in a minute. All right, uh, shooting phase is over. 
We lost a truck over here, minor explosion. Most of the orcs that died over here was from shooting from the Storm Raven. And uh, they shot this uh, unit out. It's all gone. No assaults because uh, really there's not much to assault left. And the score right now stands at what? I've got uh, two shots. I've got 18 points. Iron Hands 18. Dan? Seven. 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 18 to 7. Looks like the. Five. 18 to 5. 18 to 5. Looks like the uh, Iron Hands might win unless Dan can pull this out of the bottom of turn 5. Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> so we're going to call it? We're going to call it. Yeah, all right. Awesome. That was good, Dan. Good game. Good. And this is how it ends. All right, guys. We'll wrap this up. We'll have this put out for you. What do you think the unit for you, Dan, was that did the most? Oh, the terrain. The terrain. Yes, it was. <laughs> Cover saves. And I'm going to probably say that bikes for you, right? I, I, you know, it's, it's a toss-up between the bikes and the Sikarin. I mean, the, the Sikarin just is dealing out wounds after wounds, but I'm yeah. going to have to say the bikes. The bikes. So uh, if you're looking to build your own army, maybe you should look into bikes Look, there's still like a it. rhino left. <laughs> there is it's still, still a, a rhino, rhino left. I, All right. I was knocking out and down the kill points, but yeah. I just forgot. <laughs> you know, I couldn't, didn't have anything left by the end of the game. All right, guys. Actually, well, we're uh, done, and we'll talk to you later. Kill points.